do a, little, a nice little rainbow trifecta. Unfortunately for this one, guys, I'm not going to reroll the boss relic because I don't think it's going to feel good. Let's do choose a rare card. Nah, for a curse, doesn't seem worth it. I mean, it depends. If it's, if it's demon form or like demon form, immolate, barricade, it could be pretty spicy. I think we transform. This looks like one of those times where you probably want to get a rock bash relic. Let's do transform. Give me something juicy. I like that. Yes. All right, we'll go for two elites. Two elites, three rests. Pretty good path. Pretty ideal path, actually. Early shop. Or I could take the second secondary shop. That's probably better. Look for things like clothesline, maybe an uppercut. And take down these elites. Yeah, the best rare model death ever. I chicken a guy in the tower at the castle place and he jumped out a window. If I followed him out with my fight, flight and followed him right into the ocean where we both died. <laughs> I had a really good win yesterday. So it was top four, top three situation. I got chickened. But as soon as I got chickened, the other guy came, uh, came to fight. The hunter it was a mage and an assassin. Sorry, it was a hunter and an assassin. So I used my little chicken maneuvers to get to safety. And, I don't know, somehow I just dodged, it got clutched it out, like, it was, like, one or two seconds left. I heard her coming around the corner, but I had Legendary Withdrawal, and I had a, uh, Blast Shot. So, I, as soon as she was coming around the corner, I did a Legendary Withdrawal, she, she lost sight of me. Got a quick little snap of the bow, threw the Blast Shot, dodged and rolled, hit another bow shot, killed her, and then, from there, I healed up, killed the next guy, got the win. But it was, it was definitely a good, a one for the YouTube, I just wish I was filming it. Uh, pummel. I might do the pummel here. It feels good when you, like, you're in a top five situation, you get chickened because you fucked up, but then you manage to get out alive and then win it. That's like an amazing feeling. From chicken to win. Nothing better than that. It's time to feed my turtle. Take care on Phil too. I can't tell if that's like a, a funny way for you to to leave, or it's really or or it's really cute, you know. At, uh, glad you have a nice little pet turtle. I mean, <laughs> combust. I, I see. I like combust. Let's see what the boss is. I like combust. I think it's pretty decent. AOE five damage. I like it. Do I really like combust more than? Um, well, yeah, I do. I like Combust. I, I can't act like Combust is the reason I lose games. I think it's quite good. Hey, take care, man. Enjoy your turtle feeding time. Make sure you really feed that turtle. No, I'm kidding. No, no have a good one. I like armaments. Um, let's just shrug it off. Remove. I want something better for offense. Is it another shot? Okay. Okay. Okay, we'll use this. Combust comes in clutch here. You hear the audio? Is that just me? Is that just me, or is the auto going down? It's probably just me. Um, how is the best way for me to avoid damage here? So if I strike strike, I take... 13 damage, but I block for 5. So I'm taking 8 damage. If I do arm armaments and defend defense, so we're, we're going to be blocking for 18. And they're doing 22. So I would take 4. And if I kill, I take 7. No, I take 8. Okay. 
Oh wait, I just, I just, I just concluded the other way was better. What? I literally just did the math to show that the other way is better, and I still did, I still did a bad mistake. I'll do a cleave, so we're gonna have like a lot of AOE. I think battle trance and armaments is a great combo because you can battle trance and get a whole bunch of upgrades of armaments. Um, Twin Strike is not a bad offense. I just, right now... Ah, oh, that's right. Armaments to Strike. That was even better. Damn. It's true. Armaments to Strike. Build a 9 and then Defend Defense. And then I only take 3 damage. 1 less damage. That's optimal. That's optimal oh, gameplay. Oh. I don't think I want the Twin Strike. I think our offense is good for now. This deck's not doing that much right now. I think I'll do the bash. Just in case it's a gremlin, I want to have that. Centennial Puzzle's okay, it works for combusts. See, bash is bad in this situation, but armaments is fantastic. And... She, she's not gonna wake up. Which is fine, because I actually don't want... Him to wake up yet, or her, whatever, it. That's ideal top deck. Now we can... Don't need to wake up. We don't need to wake him up, actually. We can wait for Bash. No problem waiting for Bash here. I'll do Region Pot. Why not? That's... Well, okay, I guess now we do, sh like... Try to get another Armaments. Mm, like, I'll do Bash, and then... That's perfect. Now we're fine. Ooh. Ooh, this is see I got a lot of defense, but I also kinda wanna like do 15 damage in the face. To me that's worth it. Even 13 damage is worth it, but I I got defense. See, I it's either I I block four damage or I do sixteen damage. You gotta ask yourself, in my opinion, I think 16 damage is gonna end the fight sooner than that 4 damage is gonna help me. I could be wrong. Most of my whole deck's upgraded now, so that's fantastic. Yeah, better to race, exactly. That's why I should be maybe not block- I mean, I haven't been blocking the full. But he doesn't- Stop my combust damage, right? So I have 21 damage in three turns. I can block in four, or I can do eight damage. Well, let's see. Next turn, I have potentially cleave, strike, strike, which is going to be eight, eight, ten, twenty-six plus the seven. So it's better for me to block because um, there's a big chance I get lethal next turn, anyways. And GG. That was beautiful. We got old coin. That's fantastic. I kind of like the entrench. But we don't have... Like, okay, if I take the entrench... It's not good right now. It really isn't. It would be a curse. But there's a chance that barricade's going to be dropped from the boss. Am I willing to just take the entrench now and try to get that chance? Old coin gives me 300 gold. Not bad. I don't know. I guess I don't take the curse, right? But there's there's a decent chance it's going to be barricaded, in which case I, I, I'll be glad to have this. I mean, if I upgrade... Well, here's the thing. I can upgrade it. And upgrading it still gives it some value, because it would be like another defense in my deck. I'll do it. But it's gonna be, it's, okay, I'm already regretting it, probably. Why isn't what working? Unfortunately, Spider Bot's down. I'm not sure why. Do you know anything about some of the seeds that you post on YouTube, like the Meteor Strike seed with Sneko, like giving you Sneko, uh... 
Oh, so Meister, uh, I think this has to be in Center 15. So the seeds have to be in Center 15 as far as my knowledge is concerned because they were Center 15 seeds. I think that makes a difference. Also, I did it on the beta. I did it on the beta branch of Center 15. So one of those things might be messing you up. I think Rampage is pretty decent. I like it. That was a bad turn. That was a bad turn. I'm getting a lot of these. I'm getting a lot of weird cards. I mean, I'm getting the same cards over and over again, like the Pommel, the Armaments, and Spin Strike. I'm gonna just skip because I have Rampage. Although Pommel is not bad with the Rampage, but yeah, I'm gonna skip. I'm gonna go for an Elite though. Frozen Egg is very nice. Very ideal Elite with my deck right now. Super ideal. It also could be because a patch came in, right? A patch probably messed it up. I'm not sure. It was... I wish I wasn't taking as much damage as I am, but... I can't control. Can't control this, uh... It's RNG. Hey, everything's good, Champagne. Good to see you, man. Have fun with the lurkage. Wow, what a draw. Holy mackerel. What a draw. There's the entrench curse. I'm hoping it's gonna pay off. I'm gonna be happy I got the entrench, don't you worry. Okay, maybe I won't, but... Yeah, the rupture. Okay, bag of marbles, okay. Sentinel, Thunderclap, Second Wind. I don't really like any of these. I could do Second Wind to make the deck smaller for the Rampage. Nah, I'm gonna skip. I'm gonna upgrade the Rampage, and I think we should be fine. We should be fine. I'm only upgrading Rampage so I can get that scaling before. Now, I'm a little worried because there's a chance that... I just lost Rampage, wow. Armaments is doing 15 plus 11. It's good enough. Alright. I think, for the most part, we're in the clear because we can um, just scale up Rampage and try to consistently defend. I would like to have a weaken, but it's okay. Like, not having a weekend makes this fight a little bit worse. I'm on a 30 turn clock with the combust. It's quite generous. Like, Bash Rampage is fine here. I'm gonna do this just so I can draw again, right? Cycle the deck quicker, get the Rampage going. No point in me doing that. I guess I want I get one damage. Whatever. There's the rampage. Like I gotta play it no matter what. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. We're kind of on a clock though, you know. So taking damage kind of sucks. 
I guess I'll take the rampage, but I kind of want to look. Ooh, I have. Mm. I might have bash. Okay. That's fine. Next turn we have battle trance. We should be fine. I want to do defend bash because if I draw into rampage, we have lethal, and I think it's worth it. I think that's worth it. Mm, we'll see. Lethal. Whew, okay. The deck's okay. The deck needs some work. We got the barricade and we got the entrench. I said it's gonna happen. It happened. Not that not to mention we got the frozen egg. Frozen egg with it. So we can go for the energy on the runic dome, or we can go for Snekawai, get the card draw, get the barricade out ASAP. And yes, it makes the upgrade a little bit worse because you know it's two costs, but now the costs are random. It makes Entrench a little bit better. I don't have to upgrade it. It makes Armaments kind of good, too, because if I'm drawing seven cards, I can upgrade all my cards with Armaments. You know, and not to mention... Snickawai can open up a lot of possibilities with... A lot of other cards. Uh, the Rooney Tome is not bad, though. Snicko or no balls? Yeah, I know, it sucks that... What about Astrolab? Astrolab is not the play. Not the play. We could go for a small barricade deck with Rampage, take Astrolab, and try to have a small defensive barricade deck with Entrench. Now think about this. We keep the deck super small, we block up, get some uh, armaments value, cycle the Rampage a lot, use Entrench often, as often as we can, and then we have a lot of defense, Rampage is doing the scaling, we're done. Or we can go Snake Y, which also scales up the Rampage, but it makes it a little bit less, um, less consistent. And honestly, I think since we're using the... Since we're using the battle trains so much, and that's such an important part of cycling our deck and getting our card draw, I'm a little worried about Stick Away. I'm a little worried about Stick Away because I think battle trains are super important to our deck. Yeah, ideally, but the thing is, I only have like two. One two cost thing that's barricade. The rest is cheap. Entrench can be cheap. I'm gonna do Runic Dome. I know I didn't take the Snickle, but honestly, because Battle Trance is and super important for me. I don't know. I think it's gonna mess me up. So we have a lot of gold though, so we can go the shop and then we can skip the elites or we can do one elite, two elites. Mm, what's the alternative? We can do this path and do. One elites, four rest. I mean, you probably want to skip the path. You probably want to skip elites. I mean, I can always change it up and do elite at the end. But I, for now, I'm going to skip the elite. So now we have a barricade deck. So let's try to make that work. <laughs> a barricade deck, but I'm not blocking. We don't have that much block. We do, but we didn't draw into it. Okay. Ah. GG. Okay. Shrug it off. You know, that's a decent block. Uppercut's not bad for the weekend, but you know what? I, I want more blocky block. I would like a weekend, though. bad. Draw into Barricade. I suppose we can always do Rampage things. This deck is kind of nice and small. I want to keep it small. I don't like how much damage I'm potentially about to take right now. I'm going to do this. Let's not talk about that. I don't want anybody to even mention it. Don't don't even nothing happens. 
What are you talking about? What are you talking about? Nothing happened. I want to upgrade entrenched. I did the exact opposite. I de I I downgraded my brain is what I did there. Wow. Wow. The value. Should warn you. <laughs> Warning, you're about to be an idiot. Warning, you're on stream. Warning, don't. They should warn me. Okay. Slow fight. It really is. This deck. This deck can get. It will. It will speed up once we get some things. I got tranced. Burning packs. You know, I like kind of the exhaust just to start getting rid of some of these strikes, and that's pretty nice. The card draw is nice, but. The exhaust is nice as well to get rid of the strikes. Make the deck nice and, uh... Oh, he's probably attacking me, isn't he? He's probably attacking me. Oh, he's not. Ooh. That's sexy. That's sexy. This is less sexy. A little bit less so. Yikes. It's all good. We get, we're gonna get a- Oh, wait. This guy's confusing me. He's not- Isn't he supposed to- Okay, I'm just gonna get a little bit of block just to- did they change him? Isn't he supposed to attack twice? My deck is... I like it, man. I like the small battle trance, burning packed, armaments, entrenched deck. I like it. Oh my. Okay. Let's skip. Okay, I have a lot of gold. What do you got for me? I said we were going to get the waffle. I didn't actually think we were going to get the waffle, but I'll take the waffle. Mummified hand is not bad. Give us, we can start taking more powers, but we only have one power right now. It can open up other things. I like the uh, lantern. I like the flame barrier. I like secret weapons and pull rampage up and get that going. I kind of like the waffle too, but not really. I like the lantern. I like the flame barrier. I like removing a strike. Flame Barrier, remove strike. I think we'll take the lantern. I like the waffle a little bit. Although secret weapon for the rampage is not bad. In fact, I could upgrade secret weapon and always pull the rampage and just keep that scaling. Secret weapon's gonna be good body slam too, right? I can pull up the body slam, I can pull up the rampage and keep doing that. The waffle's not as important right now. Because I think once we are get the deck rolling, we're not taking that much damage. I like secret weapon a lot. Okay. Let's go this way. Interesting. Not a bad turn. So we can we can even do secret weapon to get the strike out of the cycle, right? Like get out of my cycle. It's 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 some good tech. I'll tell you that much. I'm trying to block up a little bit, although I do want to attack. Well, I was gonna, I was gonna do entrench. I forgot it wasn't upgraded. Ooh, see, I want to do this, but I also, mm, get rid of the combust. Man, I, I just, I, I can't get. It's hard for me to get my foot in the door. That's more like it. Now we're good. What we need is like a in, impervious or like a power through. Maybe, m ideally a ghostly armor to get some value. Ooh, we have... Bash. Rampage. Okay, we might take a little bit of damage, but... Nothing that it's too much to worry about. And now we are in the clear. Okay. Yeah, we need impervious to help us get there. 
get rid of this. Do this. Get all the upgrades. Entrench again. And I don't know why I'm striking. I should have done this first. Okay, we're good. Slow and steady wins the race. I need upgrade entrench, I know. Another barricade? Are you kidding me? Oh, that's kind of unfortunate. It almost, like, bothers me that, that I got a barricade from the boss and I'm getting, like, this willy-nilly. Like, they don't even care about barricade. They're just dropping it left and right. It makes it less special. Okay. Well, let's upgrade the battle trench and the entrench. Both of them. But ideally, we want, like, an impervious. I can fight this. But I also don't have to take the risk. But this, this does give me card selection. I'm a little worried about this fight, actually. I mean, once I get rolling, I'm fine, but I had the potential to not get rolling. I will fight it. You know what? I have to... I'm not letting them take my gold. Ah, fuck. Uh, I think they're taking my gold, guys. I think I'm gonna lose my gold. No! Actually, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Ooh, I kind of want to do this. I kind of want to do strike here. I know I could look for barricade, but... Wait, he was going to kill himself anyways with the combust. I didn't think about that. Ooh, this has to be a big turn of block. Please give me block. Please give me block. Okay. I don't even think I have time to do barricade. I don't even think I have time to do barricade. Yikes. Wow, I gotta rest. I think I gotta rest. I mean, let's see. What's the what's the path looking like? I could be greedy and not rest. And upgrade things like the battle trains. I'm, let's upgrade battle trends. That's not bad. I'll rest once, just to be safe. Barricade, first turn. Can you imagine? See, I'm getting rid of secret weapon. I guess that's fine. Just get that going. Although, Cleave is pretty good right now for the AoE. But getting Rampage going ASAP seems to be pretty good as well. In fact, let's start killing this guy if we can. I like Combust in this fight as well, especially if the Combust is upgraded, because that's 7 AoE, so that's an upgraded Combust, just like I asked for. So that guy is going to be dead next turn. If I get a Cleave, even better, which I'm getting Cleave this turn, probably. Beautiful, and we can get the Barricade out. Although Barricade is not, again, kind of slow in this fight. I think the Barricade's a little slow in this fight. I'd rather strike. This is a scary fight, actually. I like blocking because the 7 damage is pretty good, and then Rampage is going to kill the next one. Alright, we have Lethal on both. Whew, it's rough, man. Uppercut for the weekend. That's pretty good. I'll take it. I kind of... See, a part of me wants to do the Elite. Because if I do the Elite, then I can maybe get some relics to help me out. But how are my chances against the Elite? So if it's the Book of Stabbing... Let me see. If it's the Book of Stabbing... Yo, good good job, JD. Who, who'd you play? It's not that expensive. I mean, oh yeah, now we have the two cost uppercut. It's a little expensive, yeah. A little expensive. Well, I think we can handle Leap because if it's the, um, if we get the Entrench going, we're fine. The Slavers are the problem, right? If we get Slavers, we're probably worried about the Slavers. 
So it's a one in three chance that I, I don't do well. But even then, I have the red mass to kind of mitigate the first turn. I'm going for the elite. It's a slavers, of course. We got barricade, though. It was worth it just to play the combust. The problem with that is I don't get the rampage and trench. That's something we 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 have to take a take a. I didn't think about that. Not that it matters as much. Because we still get like flame barrier cleave. Maybe it's better to just get pummel out of the way. Is cleave worth it as opposed to like blocking? I think blocking might be better. I'm gonna be vulnerable. What a difference. What a difference. I'll take the true grit. I mean, at some point I feel like I might be getting my deck too small, but I'll take one. Each ever science is not a judgeable play. Ah, uh, the gold or the dagger? I don't like the dagger in this deck. I'll, I'll just get the gold. I don't like the dagger in this deck. I mean, the dagger in this deck could be interesting because it's going to be, like, a lot of damage by the end. Not a lot. It's going to be a decent amount of damage for Act 3. Nah, I don't think it's necessary. I'm looking for a shot. Bites. Could be good. Could be good. A, a deck that has... No, it's not because I only have two strikes left. Okay. I'm going to rest. Although... Yeah, we're gonna rest. I have to use the bathroom again. A lot of, a lot of water I've been drinking. Stay hydrated. Let's see, if we see the first turn that we get. If we get barricade first turn, is GG. Ah, uh, okay. Not that great. Let's get the strike out of the deck. Actually, let's get the rampage going. Let's get the pummel out of the deck. All right, I'll be right back. All right, guys. Sorry for the delay. Sorry for the delay, guys. All right, we're looking for our barricade, and we don't want the strikes. And <gasps> what? All right, so welcome to this fight. Uh, let's get the rampage going. Yeah. All right, so we're looking for our barricade. There it is. I'll take the damage now. They're probably gonna take my flame barrier, right? I, the com I, don't actually, I actually don't want the combust. My flame barrier is pretty useful, but okay, let's do this. I still have my entrench, which is all that matters. I like the weaken on the boss, but I also just wanna get entrenched doing his thing. I can't use True Grit right now because it's too risky. I guess I like this. I would really prefer, though, for this uh, those defenses to be upgraded because they don't feel as good like that. Perfect. We get a big armament here. This is exactly what we want to see. That's exactly what you want to see. We're going to get the, the Rampage going just to get rid of the... This. I want to get that Flame Barrier back. And we can start removing this. Actually, I like keeping my defense. I could true grip, but I'd rather true grip something else first. The 
think we should be okay. We should be ahead of the curve. My next master for emotes with Darth Shooks. I have. I, I'm trying to become a partner. <laughs> I can't even get emotes until I become a partner, unfortunately. Yeah, I'll trigger the strike. I could do armament just to upgrade the cleave and stuff. Breaks been killer today? How so? The runs have been great, man. Love the runs have been fantastic. This mini uh, affiliates, so I can have one emote, right, for affiliate. How's that work? Okay, so you can still get subbed as an affiliate, right? So have support for the streamer. But partner is something that we're like the Twitch decides, okay, I have a, a, you, we want to become a partner with you. And then there's some contract thing going on and they have some negotiation about, I think, pricing or whatever it is. And then you can get sub emotes. So that's just how it works. Let's, uh... That's just... Should I get rid of the uppercut at this point? I feel like I should. We have good diamonds. We've seen some of the new relics. We have. Welcome, man. I'm gonna get rid of the combusts. And we're gonna go ahead and get entrenched again. Right? Deck's getting smaller. At this point, we're gonna start getting smaller and smaller deck for the entrenched and this rampage. And then... <laughs> This deck is actually ideal, guys. We have a small little Rampage Entrench deck. I want it to be juicier, but it, it for what it does, it does it well. It does it damn well. We have two things to exhaust. Burning Pact and True Grid, so we should be able to exhaust every single turn. And there it is. Needs a body stamp to kind of get ramp it up. I agree. I agree. My true grit. The defense. It's getting smaller and smaller. I can get rid of armaments now. I had lethal. My bad. My bad, my B, my B, my B. Don't be mad, don't be mad. GG! The third barricade has been offered. I'm kind of insulted. This could have been a triple barricade deck. And there we go. That's the new relic, Coffee Dripper. We're gonna take it, because you don't need a rest, right? Who needs resting? I probably am going to need a rest. But I kind of want to do Coffee Dripper. So we're doing it. If we need to rest, too bad. Too bad. Okay, let's go for the shop. Shoppy, shoppy, shoppy. And then let's go for uh, another late shop. Well, eh, we could do a late. I need a body slam. I really need a body slam. I need more card draw, because now I have all this energy. All this energy. Now I can't rest, so all this damage feels pretty damn bad. But we are the Ironclad, so you know what? We heal with that. Didn't think about that for a second. Who needs resting when you have burning blood? Spider Bot's having a day off. Um, skippy, skippy. We're, we're liking the way our deck is functioning. 
Ah, uh, this is awkward. That's awkward. You can also heal off Reaper, you know? I think Ironclad is probably the best person to take the... Take this, uh, Coffee Dripper. Turns out the Ironclad is the one that really likes coffee the most. Reaper's not good in this deck, but yes, Reaper could be a way that you can still heal outside of resting, right? I don't know. I don't need the Reaper. I don't know. I'm saying my deck's gonna be fine. I'm gonna heal. I'm gonna heal Burning Blood. I'm saying, you know, in other decks, like Demon Form decks or Strength decks, you can even heal with the Strength decks, right? So it's not like I'm saying Ironclad. I think is the best with this deck, with this Relic, rather. I suppose, I mean, even the Defects, the Defects has self-repair, but maybe not so much. I'm gonna die to the Dripper, you guys, okay. There's the Body Slam, the deck's getting better already. Look at this guy. Look at this dude. I like the Uppercut. My friends, this one hurts quite a bit. That's a big hit. My god. Wow, wow, wee wow. Okay, look, luckily we got the uh, armaments. Mm hmm. Flame barrier. I want to get the barricade out. I really do, but the thing is. Alright, I'll do the barricade. Alright, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna get rid of the strike, alright? We're gonna entrench, we're gonna body slam. Not only am I doing damage with the body slam, I'm blocking at the same time. So now we're good. We got through it. We did it. We did it. Just sucks that I took that damage, right? So what, what caused that bad, that bad draw? I would say draw needs to combust, right? So I want to minimize those turns where I have bad draws. I don't want those turns to ever happen again. Offering. Oh my word. Alright, so I think we do want to remove the strike, right? I kind of like the... Thinking ahead as well. I need to see card draw. So, like, anything that gives me card draw. Offering with no heal? Uh, you know, the card draw the offering is going to give me is going to be worth it. It's going to be worth it. It's gonna, it's gonna, I think offering is going to end up preventing damage. The last relic is called uh, Running Through Decahedron. Oh, over here is Coffee Dripper. Who's the boss? Letter opener is alright. I think it's not worth it. Is there another shop? There is, right? So I think I'm going to save money for another removal. I'm removing the strike for sure. And I think thinking ahead is fine, but I actually want... I might just save money. I think I'll take one of these potions just to be safe. I need card draw, man. I need bag of prep. My deck would do so well bag of prep. Like, my first turn is so pivotal. There's the barricade. Okay, fuck it. Yeah, the first turn is so pivotal to me. Eeh, this is gross. I can't even use- Oh, that's gross, dude. It's worth it. Mm. 
I'm trying to save money for another removal. Secret weapon and body slam is such a good combo. It's ridiculous. It's actually such a nice combo. <laughs> okay. Headbutt for the body slam. Headbutt for the entrench. I think that's really nice. Let's upgrade the... Like, offering is so important just to get the card draw. Although, no, I already have Centennial Puzzle. That's, that's pretty bad. Duplicate a card. Okay, duplicating the um, offering is kind of bad, right? Because I'm going to be losing a lot of life. But at the same time... Okay, if I duplicate Battle Trance... Drawing into Battle Trance feels bad, but... No, no, no. So, Entrenched Slam... See, here's the thing. Once I'm already going, I'm not worried about the block. It's about getting at the first two turns. The turns where I don't have Barricade. So, I need card draw to make sure I can draw into those cards. So, I think Battle Trench are offering, are for me, the picks. Nah, I can't be Entrenched, guys. Because if I have a first turn of double Entrenched, what am I doing? No, absolutely nothing. Super important to uh, for me to, to to draw. In the future, you can add Moobot to give people points for being in the chat and can set up a gambling after floor for one. Can get... Okay, that's a good that's a good idea. It's a good idea. I think Battle Trance is a play. Although it feels good that to have multiple. But there's nothing better than having a first turn Battle Trance. Well, this is kind of bad. I should have done Shrug It Off first. Ah. This is bad. I might take a lot of damage here. We're fine. I need, dude, Barricade's the last card in my deck. Wow, man. I like the weekend. I need to headbutt the entrench now. There's no point in body slamming for one. Devil. GG. Oh man, strawberry, nice. Gambler's Rouge is really good as well because that helps me get the cards I need. Singing Bullet gives you some healing. Barricade first turn, that's ideal. That's so ideal. Holy moly, okay, it's GG. If I get Barricade first turn, I'm set. Entrench again. Alright, I gotta remove Combust. But I wanna remove the last strike first. <laughs> Another shrug it off. It's not bad. Nah, I don't need it. There's another one, Incense Burner. That's the other one. Uh, the Metallicize isn't that bad, but I, I want to be able to remove Strike. Because I think we're not going to need Metallicize. So, I'm going to remove the Strike. That's just, looks, looks kind of nice art. I like it. This isn't a charity. Hey, buddy, you got no money. Hmm. Oh. Let's remove. I'm happy with this deck. I kind of like 
dexterity power for this boss, but I think the gamma shrink is really good as well. So is the swift potion. We can go for an event, maybe get some removal, maybe get some other stuff like healing, or we can go for the upgrade. What, what would we upgrade? We don't have that much to upgrade. I upgrade the true grit, but I might just go here. I can get the event for heals. I could also get the events for Mind Blue or something. Oh, I guess I lose the Combust. I actually happy about that. I didn't want Combust anymore. War Paint. Let's upgrade this as well. And I can go for the I can go for the Elite. Because I think the Giant Head I beat, no problem. The Intangible Guy we just beat. And it's the Double Orb Walker. So it's either Giant Head or Double Orb Walker. The Double Orb Walker might be bad. They might be bad, but uh, fuck it. Let's do this. More heal. Okay. Let's upgrade the true grit. Alright, we should be fine. It's all about the first couple turns. First two turns. I'm gonna do this. And then this. Ooh, that's bad. We drew into offering. That's kind of bad. Alright, let's weaken him. It's a bad turn to draw offering, man. Alright, it's okay. We can always draw back into offering. Getting barricade last doesn't feel good. It does not feel good. Okay. Okay. Shrug. True grit the rive. I like Entrench. I like Shrug, Entrench, Headbutt the Entrench. Or I could do Entrench, Headbutt the Entrench. No, no. I like Shrug, Entrench, Headbutt the Entrench. Offering still hasn't been played. I'm gonna use this dexterity pot at some point. It's probably a good turn to use dexterity pot. Let's bring Entrench back. Let's do a rampage. Trench again, huh? I don't need Rampage anymore. Let's headbutt the Entrench. I could, I could exhaust one of the Battle Trench. I don't need double Battle Trench. I have lethal here. GG! Cool deck, man. Cool deck. Coffee filter was... I think coffee filter is the best on the arc, by, by far. But, you know, that's why... Um, it's, it's kind of funny, like... I don't know. I, th I took Entrench early, and it was a curse. And I was like, okay, there's a big chance we're going to get barricade. We got lucky with the barricade. But then we got barricade three times after. So I think take it in trench early when your deck... Like, if you're going against the Guardian and you think your deck can handle the Guardian regardless, it's not too bad because my deck was, like, in the, the right position to go for barricade deck. So the entrench early wasn't a bad idea.